everyone, welcome back to another video. And today's video, I'm gonna be talking about five bag chains you really need in your handbag collection. You guys may have already seen my previous collaborations with Next Fashion, and this time I have another video for you guys. I did feel like I talked about a bunch of bag chains in those videos, but I wanted to kind of narrow down like the top five basic chains that you need and I'm gonna go through them today. So this is also sponsored by Next Fashion and if you guys haven't watched my previous videos, Next Fashion is a Canadian brand that focuses on bag chains and I'm so excited to be working with them once again. So I'm gonna go ahead and jump right into this video. The first bag chain that I want to talk about is a cross body bag chain. So this is going to help you transform your shoulder bags into an actual crossbody bag and it's just gonna let you be completely hands-free that way you don't have to worry about your straps falling off your shoulder and that way you can just be completely carefree especially when you're in the mall or grocery shopping so the one I have here I will also link down in the description below but it is this one and this is my absolute most favorite because of how good quality this looks it's smooth and has a good weight to it this is the 40 inch long crossbody chain and it works perfectly for me and it just hits right at my hip. Now I am five foot three for those of you guys who haven't watched my other videos or know already. And I would highly suggest this. It is a lot more comfortable um, cross body strap, but I can still wear it on one shoulder though it is a little bit longer and it goes past my hip a little bit. You can also carry these chains in your bag so you can wear it as a one shoulder strap bag. And when your activities change, you can completely just transform your bag and be completely hands free and not worry about anything. The next strap I'm gonna be talking about is great for small leather goods or any other small mini bags that you have. In this case, I have my Louis Vuitton mini pochette and the strap that I want to talk about is this wristlet. Now, this is perfect for any mini bags or even wallets and card holders that you guys have and you just want to go out with your wallet and be a little bit more secure. I would highly recommend a wristlet like this. I personally have this thick braided strap and I just like that a lot more than kind of like the flat um, classic curb chains, just because the way it rolls on your wrist, it just feels very comfortable and secure. Fortunately, with the mini pochettes, you can actually um, create it into a wristlet yourself and use the existing chain, but not all small bags have this, so I would just highly recommend getting a wristlet and you can completely transform your small leather goods. The third chain I'm gonna show you guys is this little mini bag chain. So I always go for this strap when I am using my mini pochette just because the original one is very thin. And when I use that one, the bag feels a little bit bare. So I do like to add on a little bit of a thicker curb chain and have the existing chain as kind of like the accent. And it also has like this really nice sound to it when the chain hits the canvas. So I personally like that sound when I am using the bag and I just like having this chain. It completely transforms the look. If you guys want to as well, you can switch it the other way around and carry the thinner chain on top and have this kind of a thicker, chunky accent on your small leather good. So if you guys want to save money and you don't want to get a wristlet, you can just totally get something like this as well. And basically it's a two-in-one so you can have a small chain and a wristlet as well. Now the only thing is that it might feel a little bit bulkier and not long enough because now you have these two clasps that are on this D-ring versus one. So it's totally up to you whether you guys just want like a two-in-one product, save money and not get the wristlet, or just get two and have two different options to wear as a wristlet on its own or just a regular chain on your SLG. The fourth chain that I'm gonna share with you guys is the Chunky Statement chain. And this is my absolute favorite chain. I've mentioned this in my second collaboration video with Next Fashion. So I wanna show you what this looks like on two different pieces that I have. The first one is this Louis Vuitton Toiletry Pouch 26. And look at how nice of an accent this chain is on it. It does give it a lot of more of like a utility vibe and it's just a really nice accent to it. It's very easy. 
I do have an insert in this bag that I attached the chain to the D-rings. I do know the toiletry pouch, I believe, is going to be discontinued by the time this video comes out, but I do highly recommend this bag still and with this chain combination, especially if you guys are planning to get this bag brand new from a reseller, um, pre-loved or anything like that. I love how simple this look is, but the chain just does add a little bit of a shine and a statement to it. And this is what the statement chain looks like on the pochette accessoire. You can definitely use this as a shoulder bag as well, and it just completely changes the look of the bag. It does give it a lot more of a bolder look compared to everything else, and it's mainly because of the thick chain itself and these o-rings so that is one of the reasons why i really love this strap it does look a little bit better on the toiletry pouch in my opinion or just something that is kind of like square in my other video i did show a ted baker bag as well and i guess i'll just show you guys in this video so that you guys can see what i mean so i want to put this chain onto my ted baker bag and i've worn it like this already i really really liked how it looked and also this chain was sold out for a while now on the website. I feel like this is one of the best sellers, I would have to say. Um, yeah, this is what it looks like. So I'm not sure if you guys know what I mean, but I find that this chain looks a lot better on very rectangular and square bags. I just think it complements this O-ring and just gives off a very minimal kind of effortless look to it. So the final chain that I think you guys need in your collection is kind of like the accent and decor piece. So by that, I'm going to share with you my Speedy B30 and show you what I mean. And that is having something like on your bag. So it's not like you're using it as the strap, but you just have it kind of like as decor on your bag. So my favorite one is this shorter chain with the o-ring extension. I just find that the o-rings make it so much easier to clasp onto your bag and it does create more of like an accent style as well. So I personally love this one, especially on my Speedy. I would also highly recommend something like this if you guys do have the Louis Vuitton Alma BB. And you don't need to use like an o-ring style to do this. I can show you another one that I have that I showed earlier which is for your mini bags and that works really well as well. For example, you can also use this mini curb chain as well. It just creates a different look. It's not as like busy and bulky as the o-ring extensions. So if you guys are a little bit more like quieter with accessorizing your bag, I would personally go with this one instead of the o-rings. If you guys do want more of like an eye catcher, I would definitely go with the o-rings. Just to reiterate, I showed five types of bag chains that I think everyone should have in their collection. The first one is a crossbody chain, and I personally find that it's so handy to be able to turn your bags into a hands-free, easy-going bag. Of course, you can just change the chains, that was so hard to say, to get a different style between all your bags. And the other one is a wristlet. This will help you transform your wallets, card holders, any SLGs into an easy carry wristlet, especially if you're just going out for an errand. The third one is a chain for all your mini bags. So this can also double up as a wristlet if you guys want to save money and kind of have like a two-in-one product. However, I just like to have both because it'll make it more versatile. Sometimes if you guys double up on the chain, it will have two clasps on the D-ring and it might seem a little bit too bulky. So I would highly suggest getting a wristlet on its own so that you guys can just simplify that entirely and another bag chain for your SLGs. The next one is the accent chain that is going to make all your very minimal bags pop. And that is the thick chain one with the O-rings. I think that you can transform any existing bags that you have or even the toiletry pouch to give it a little bit more of like a utility vibe. And the last one are accent chains. So these aren't chains that you're actually using as straps like on your shoulder. These are chains that are just added to your bag for an extra flair. So, so everything in this video is by Next Fashion and of course I will link everything down below. I also do have a coupon code if you guys are interested in saving 20% off. I highly, highly recommend their chains. I'm not just saying that because I'm working with them. I truly mean it. I did buy some other chains from I think Etsy or eBay, I have that in my first video and I will link that as well. And it basically kind of cut my finger every time I opened the lobster clasp. It was overly heavy for no reason and just not good quality. With these ones by Next Fashion, you actually get 
a decent light weight because your bag is already heavy enough. You don't need any additional weight, right? And the lobster clasps, all the clasps are really easy to open. It's very smooth and I haven't like cut myself or anything. I have also had these straps for, I want to say a year now. There are no tarnishing problems or any issues I would say overall. Of course, throughout wear and tear, it's not going to be as shiny as like the first day you got it, especially if you are using it every single day. Either way, I still think it is super worth it and I would highly recommend. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys did find it helpful. Um, feel free to leave any comments on what other bag chains you think are also a necessity in your closet. It doesn't have to be for luxury bags at all either. I just happen to choose these ones because that is the bag that I see myself using these chains with specifically. And wrapping up this video, of course, if you guys are new to my channel, it would mean so much to me if you would hit that subscribe button, the notification bell, and I'll see you guys in my next video.